definitely be on Xbox One. Because here here. <laughs> controllers are literally the worst. All right. Oh, ex okay. Awesome. The force burn we were hoping for. Uh, this doesn't look like a button warm up. I guess they're tired of pushing buttons. Uh, yeah, this is not like a button check. It looks like they're getting right into it, which is very nice for them to do right after our technical difficulties. So we are seeing the force burn. Like you said, uh, I was wondering if we were going to see a different character at all. I think part of it could be how long the delay was for <laughs> Take Assault. He's uh -huh. like, all right, let me try. He's just let me pull out my trump with my ace right here. Yeah, and his force burn is so good. Yeah. And it's always been a very scary force burn. And now with, uh, basically, force burn benefits a lot from having no landing lag. He still has it on his back air and his, um, oh, oh and he kills him with combust. He still has it back on air and down air, but uh, his neutral air, his forward air, his up air, they all auto cancel. So... That allows him to just string his together. Here you see him just chaining just Crag across the, the stage. The whole, yeah, the whole stage. Like. So Force Burn, you can kind of play him two different ways. You can play him a little more deception-y now uh, using his special attacks, uh, like his smoke, or you can play him very combo heavy. And if you play him that style, Whoa. wow, he All right. used this pillar. He broke yeah. the pillar on purpose and let himself fall yeah. to take that stock. That was the Force Burn version of the uh, Setter Burn. Uh, suicide. Yeah, that <laughs> was very ballsy, but I think he knew where they were and and the how stock lead he was comfortable with. I yeah. Think, yeah, and let's see, he'll he's happily do it again here. Yeah, if he can. yeah. Once again, he's gonna say, "I'll take you off stage right now." If I have a stock lead, I'm not too worried about it. Forsman doesn't have the best recovery in the game, but when you have a lead like that, you can play a little riskier. Yeah, something here too. Uh, Kick, that Kicksalt's doing is he's on point with uh, destroying the pillar. A lot of times, uh, it kind of gives Crags a breathing, a little breathing room because they'll be in a spot you're not expecting. It'll be a place you can't hit, but almost immediately, every time he pulls it out, uh, Force Burn's just destroying it. Oh wow! And he missed MSP. landing on the pillar. Yeah, just went for the pillar instead of trying to. Oh, I don't know if he ever actually hit ground. Uh, yeah, I think his pillar was out there, and he didn't have another one. I'm pretty sure Kicksalt just went random. Yep, so tagging's a, a very similar melee, actually, the way we implemented it, where, uh, yeah, if you hit too early, you get locked out, uh, but if you hit it within 20 frames of hitting the ground, then you'll get a tech, and you can tech neutral tech uh, backwards or forward, and if you don't tech, it's not as punishing as it is in Smash. Uh, there's, like, a very short knockdown state uh, that we actually call, like, a hit-stun land because you don't lay down, and wow. We're here in the crowd. Uh. Yeah, the crowd <laughs> is getting into this Mabel. I... I don't know if I've seen Kikasol play Mabel. Um, no, I mean, I don't know if he's played a lot. He's randomed it, so <laughs> we don't even know how happy he is about picking it. He showed today that he's very good at a lot of different characters and a lot of matchups. Yeah, and he's got the uh, the game lead, too, since he's going from the winner's bracket, so yeah. he's not too worried. Oh, and MSB saying I'm not to be trifled with. Uh, you're going to random against me. I am going to punish you. Yeah, up one nothing. Uh, Kikasol is definitely feeling himself going random, getting Maple, and then playing Pretty super aggressive. Yeah, <laughs> very good Maple, very aggressive. I mean, that's the way you have to play with her. Mm -hmm. But he's definitely using her speed really well, kind of staying out of the range where Crag wants to work, and then very quickly closing the gap when uh, MSP is not quite ready. Yeah, that was like a little bit of a, a test. He's like, oh. Put my force burn out, and he's like, uh, oh, you're not ready for the real me. I'm just gonna go question mark. And right there, you saw how plant works in the newer updates where it attacks now when opponents get close, which means MSB actually used it to his advantage right there, where he walked up and parried it uh, to get a little bit of invincibility frame to give him some breathing room. So while Lily has pretty good stage control for Maple, um, there are ways around it now. It's not a, a something that you can just camp around because your opponent nice uses it against you. Yeah, I wonder if we're going to see, uh, we did talk about MSB being, uh, wow, wrapped up smash. He had 140%, so yes, that will combo into itself, which means you basically just get to add a little bit of damage and still get your smash attack off. Definitely gives you a moment to uh, make peace. Yeah, and lower crack. percents when you land that, um, it doesn't combo into another uh, strong attack anymore, which it used right. to do pretty well around 50. Ooh. Now it uh, would only combo into a tilt or something fast. Oh, Maple. Okay, that's great for MSB to get back on stage here because Maple was definitely about to shut him out. Um, yeah. Keep him off. Kegasol was looking for that uh, forward air. And nice. Then. All right. 
And uh, this is again back to the uh, heavy and and lightness here, where uh, this isn't end of the day for Crag at all. He can definitely set up a chain here and take this game no problem. Yeah, if you can get Mabel off stage, that was a very good nice parry. Berry. I probably would have gotten hit by that there and been off stage in a very bad situation as Mabel. Ooh, and uh, expecting the parry, MSB cancels his uh, his rollout. Wow, oh. that was such both players just. just Nerves of steel right there <laughs> to be able to fight on top of that pillar at the percent they're at because Mabel and I think that'll be goes. it. The wrap up. Mabel would have definitely well, died from that up strong with how high they were. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, let's see this uh, replay we got here. Oh, this is the first stock, yeah, where he just stuffs them early, keeping them off stage and then forward air for the KO. Uh huh. Oh, oh all right, an Edelis. I don't MSB know. with a big grin on his face, so I don't know if you. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Cake Assault as uh, Atlas. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Oh, he's yeah. pulling pull, pull random. So yeah. I don't know if he played random or if he picked the Game Boy Atlas. I imagine he played random. Yeah. Because I notice players who play with the Game Boy colors usually <laughs> only use Game Boy colors. So right. I bet you this was a random Atlas pick for Game 3 at Super Smash Con Grand Finals. Yeah, this is Grand's. MS or, uh, Cake Assault thinks he's got this sewed up. Let's see if uh, MSB can tell Ooh. him something else. MSB All right. takes the stock very early. Kick Assault, we have not seen him lose yet. He's very confident. He's picking random. He's playing every character extremely well. Oh, he's down to one stock yeah. now, though. Oh! oh! Wow. <laughs> <laughs> but right there, he's like, nope, I'm still in this. That is actually one of my favorite moves in the game. Uh, Edelis can actually grab the opponent in the air and uh, do an overhand dunk. So uh, Yeah, toss him down and forward, and it has very strong knockback. Yep. Uh, you can DI it, obviously, and... Uh, you can check it and all that stuff. It's not just like a, a kill every time, but it can combo at low percents, which is really cool, and it can also be uh, really nice off stage when you fall through someone and just like whip them down and stuff like that. Yeah. So at higher percents, what you can do is if you di in, you can usually clip the level depending on where they threw you um, and tech on the ground. That was a very cool chain by Craig. Actually, yeah, that, that was neat. Nice. He wave landed onto uh, the pill. He Onto the uh, high platform there. All right, cool. He's going to show it again. Yeah. All right. Oh, so, yeah. Nice. Oh, yeah, that was beautiful. So he canceled his rollout by hitting his pillar and yeah. then immediately made another pillar and came right into it. All right, these guys are going fast and furious. They already started another game. Oh, oh my, my goodness. Jake Assault starts off his Absa match with a zero to death. <laughs> So Absa, we're going to turn like a lightning round of the yeah, whole roster right now. You guys want to know how all these characters work? <laughs> <laughs> so Cake Assault playing random, showing that he does not, he thinks that he can just make it work with anyone right now. And uh, you know, it's not arrogance if you are doing it. So. Yeah, it's not going to be arrogance when he, uh, you know, takes first place if he does it. So, yeah. he so it looks like it's not going to come back to bite him. Yeah, he actually has overstock lead in the Absa vs. Crag matchup, which has usually been in Absa's favor, uh, mostly because sweet spots are easier to land on a bigger target, and Absa's zoning uh, tends to counter Crag zoning because a rock pool is hard to get off when um, Absa can just put a cloud in your face. Right, he has to follow uh, physics uh, with throws and stuff, and she can kind of direct the cloud a lot easier to get yeah. you. Oh, there he, he just the spaces it a little bit. I can see why he would go for that because charging that would get the KO. Oh, oh, both off the Trade. stage, and now we're at down the last stock of Grand Finals at All Super right. Smash Con. All right, I hope I'm a speaker pull it back here. Not only because I love longer matches and sets, obviously, but I think he needs to say, uh, "You can't just random me with yeah. anybody. Come yeah, on, you so. can't beat me with any character." So right, right. MSB is gonna definitely. I think, yeah, we'll see what he can do here. This is it. And like, since uh, Kick Assault's playing random, I have no idea how much he... Oh! oh. oh. Into the spike chain! <laughs> wow! With Very the, nice. With the uh, sour spot, sour spot, down yeah. there, sweet spot. Oh, uh, just locking him up. Just beautiful, beautiful <laughs> yeah. combo and finishes him off. And I don't think uh, MSB was even expecting a down air there. No. Let's see if we have the Edelus combo as well. We do. Just chaining that the forward airs and just immediately dugging him off yeah, stage. Yeah, showing just multiple characters, just, just domination. I All think right. it would be cool to give